previously. No, 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 no. I didn't mean to. And so we go. Hello friends, my name is Knight, and welcome back to We Happy Few. I am in a slightly different spot than I was before, um, because I had to replay some stuff. So, yeah. And now here we are. Oh shit. Well. Oh god, I forgot about that. <laughs> Choked on my pudding. Oh, that's how I get down. Alright. Oh, I just have to find the tracks and walk on out of Wellington Woods. Alrighty. And this is where we... And this is where we left off. Stay the fuck there. Thank you. Okay. Let's see if I can actually like save it here this time. All right. <laughs> How are you guys today? I am absolutely fantastic. Pick that lock for nothing. Ah. When you need to see in the dark, you can equip the torch as long as the power cell lasts. Any torches you have will queue in and click quick slot. Note that you cannot fight without using a torch. Okay. That makes sense. Lovely. Oh. Hello. Okay. Switch replacement. There's a cake here. A little crawl space. It can't fit through. That's fine. Alright, what did I just get? Here we go. <clears throat> Dear darling Sebastian, what a brave boy you are. Daddy says you got on the train and climbed out the back into the tunnel just like we practiced. We were so worried when we saw the train pull away. What if the windows had been locked? It was agony waiting to know if you were safe. Daddy says you're cross with him for not coming earlier, but please understand it's too risky, except on days when he can inspect the tracks. Daddy will bring you food every Tuesday. Try to make it last. We don't have ration coupons for you anymore. But that's all right, as I need to reduce anyway. Courage, my little soldier. Love, mummy. P.S. I've asked Daddy to smuggle Aloysius to you. I know you think you're too big to sleep with the teddy bear, but it's good to have a comfort of home, no? My dearest Sebastian, happy birthday. I can't believe you're ten already. Of course, you're such a brave boy that you often seem much older. There's a slice of carrot cake in the box. I know it's not your favorite, but we'll have to make do just a little longer. Next year, I hope we have a proper birthday cake and candles for you. This war can't last forever. Your loving mummy. Aww. Aww. Was that Sebastian? No, that's Ned Sheeran. Instead of Ed Sheeran? I think it's instead of Ed Sheeran. Uh. <clears throat> Name, birthday notes, John Allister, 25, January 35th, oh, 25th of January, 1935, Geoffrey Alexander, okay, this is just being sent by taxi, also sent by taxi, has been crossed out, okay. I don't know if these are important or not, they're not like an alphabetical order or anything, Sebastian Dainty. Okay. Pick all the locks. That should be empty as well. Or duct tape. Sebastian, we are so worried. Daddy says you weren't in your hidey hole on Tuesday and hadn't eaten your cake. 
This is no time to be a picky eater. Where did you go? You know it's risky to go out by yourself. Please be a good boy and don't scare us like that. At least leave us a note so we know you're safe. Love, mummy. Whole bunch of luggage. That doll is absolutely terrifying. happens if I drink scotch? Do I have any... yeah. There we go. Um... Torch. Always do be careful. A D B C. Ah. Okay, switch. Oh, A D B. Figured it out. I don't trust this. So sorry, Percy. I should have got on the train with you, like I promised. The rule was if a kid was a day over 13, what could I do? You could have kept your mouth shut, Arthur, and not told them you were 13. That's what you could have done. Sovereigns. Yeah, close it. I'm going to take all these coins. I could climb that and go down there. Is there any reason to? No, not really. I guess there is. Okay. Climb. Alright. Too old to go to Germany, are you not? Please, no! You can't take care of yourself! Ah, <coughs> Bloody Bobby. 
I told him I wanted to board even if I was ten days too old, but we don't make the rules anymore, Mr. Hastings. I shouldn't have told him they got my birthday wrong. I don't even know why I did. Should have just kept quiet and got on the train. Plenty of lockpicks. Oh, yeah, I'm up here. I guess I'm following the tracks. I can't get up there, it seems. Bloody hell. There's been some sort of caving. So much for walking down the train tracks to the Britannia Bridge. <laughs> what the fuck do I do now? Oh, look. It's a little lost lamb. Where's Bo Peep? Oh, Eating a bird's in your way, I bet. <laughs> That's little Miss Muppet, you Muppet. Uh, um, uh, can we pound him now? Can we not? Yep. Uh, oh, boss. Yeah. I don't want to fight. Take it, mate. Take it, mate. You're all beaming. Fire. Ah. Uh. Uh. Can I? How do I? I need. I need. Get away from me. Can I run? No, 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 no. Close the goddamn door. No, close the door. Close the motherfucking door. Motherfucking asshole. I can't fight you guys. Damn. Can't we just agree to disagree? <sighs> Shit. Actually, no. I need to use the first aid kit. <sighs> Those take longer. Fucking assholes. Isn't there a button I can use to do something? I guess not. Okay. Those assholes are still down there. That was exciting, wasn't it?
I wonder if I hold the... Nope. Okay. Taking all the sovereigns. I get no fucks. All right, let's go. Ollie. Who's Ollie? Come for me, have you? Ollie, <laughs> I'm Arthur. You won't get me. You won't get me, you bastard. Ollie, uh, no. It's Arthur. Bloody murdering weasels. <coughs> I could go mental. I'll save you, Margaret. What? I'm your old neighbor, Artie. Always lying. Little Artie. Artie's gone. They took him away. Ollie, no. They You're didn't. You're lying. You're a Waste Ollie, it's Arthur. No way did you see that before? Oh my God, Artie! What's a Artie? Yeah, for fuck's sake! What's your mouth, laddie? What would your mum think? I <laughs> thought they took you away. <laughs> no, they had my birthday wrong. What? Sorry. No, of course not. No, you've got it all wrong. That was Jack turned you in, and I what tried to save you. Right. I remember now. <laughs> you came back from the station. The only one. You don't think they hurt him, Percy? The Germans aren't animals, you know. They just wanted to make sure he stayed quiet. And we did. Spot a tea. I like your tea That's party. Very kind of you. I I'm not thirsty. That's right, Margaret. We have to run after water. <laughs> I have to follow you. <laughs> Any idea where he might be after all these years? Not really. I know I have to get out of Wellington Wells. I, th I thought I could take the train tracks to the bridge. Aye. The only way to the Britannia Bridge is the train station and the parade. And good luck getting into the parade. You could stay here. Remember when you and Sally used to stay with me? When the... But it's young Artie. <laughs> Meg, you remember Artie, don't you? <laughs> no room at the end for young Artie? No. You're right. You're always right. Sorry. Margaret says it's best if I keep to myself. Oh. Sorry to bother. But... Margaret thinks we could help each other. Really? Uh, Brilliant. There's a warehouse in the old German camp. We could burgle it. The Victory Memorial Camp? Where all those home army chaps run around practicing stabbing people with bayonets? What, what do you want me to do there? Run around yelling, <laughs> here I am, shoot me, while you're going under the wire? There's uh, a thing I need from their warehouse. Of course there is. If you help me, I'll get you out of Wellington Wells. I just need you to turn off the power in the camp. And this isn't going to get me killed. Don't be a great girl, Blouse. I'll meet you at the bunker after dark. Don't worry about the sentries on the bridge. I'll make sure they get a good night's sleep. Trust me. I know what I'm doing. Sure. Shall I just show myself out then? Ollie? I don't actually know the way out, you know. Okay, well, I think this is a good place to end this episode here. So thank you guys so much for watching. I'll see you in the next episode of whatever I decide to make. Then that's something out.